Hi everyone, welcome back. I have Tim from Game Time, our gaming channel. We're here to talk about Kyber Crystals. We're going to go through the green Kyber Crystals that you can get at Galaxy's Edge in Florida or California. I'm showing them the label. Oh, So sorry. I have all of my Kyber Crystals labeled so I know what voices they are. So when I tell you, hey, this is a Yoda, I can tell you which Yoda it is. It helps keep track. Or I can tell you this is a Yoda and this is a Quargon. Because if we didn't have the labels, it would be so hard to figure yeah. out which ones are which. So I have all mine labeled. So he was just showing you the labels. <laughs> I was showing them your lovely handwriting. Yes, thank you. So I, we have two different ones to start out with right out of the gate. We have... Uh, Qui-Gon Jinn 1 and 2 cut, which from my previous video talking about kyber crystal cuts, uh, they have the exact same voices attached to them, uh, right? Uh, I believe so, yeah. the RFID code? Yeah, they are. Yeah, they're the same. They're both uh, RFID two, uh, 3076. Mm -hmm. So they have the same uh, voice attached to them. Um, so we're, we're just going to go through one of them. Yeah, I don't know. Close your eyes and pick one. No, that's your face. <laughs> Looks like we're going with the bigger one. So this is cut one. Like always, trying to find yeah. the hole. Um, hey -o. Name, no. Um, so, <laughs> I'm just not going to get track. Uh, so Qui-Gon... This is the Qui-Gon from the original movies, the or episodes one, two, and three, uh, or one and two, I think. Just one, he died. He oh, you're right, he one. died. That's right, Maul, Maul killed, killed him. him. Uh, Liam Neeson, also known as uh, know. the guy from Taken. Uh, he's done a lot of stuff, everyone knows him. He's a really great actor. I think it was a bit of a weird role for him, but it was cool. Yeah. I thought he was a good actor for it. Yeah. I, wish he was, I wish he lasted longer, and we got to know his character a little bit more. I feel like... He would have been... Yeah, all we had him for was with like a force ghost later. And we heard him a couple yeah. times and that was it. Well, let's, let's hear what he has to say and then our holocron. Coming at you live. Qui-Gon Jinn. Color green. All energy from the living force, from all things that have ever lived, feeds into the cosmic force, binding everything and communicating to us through the midichlorians. The midichlorians. I am a manifestation of the force. A force that consists of two parts. Living beings generate the living force, which in turn powers the wellspring that is the cosmic force. Always remember, your focus determines your reality. Short, sweet, to the point. Midichlorians are a microscopic life form that resides within all living cells. And we are symbionts with the life forms living together for mutual advantage. Without the midichlorians, life could not exist, and we would have no knowledge of the Force. They continually speak to us, telling us the will of the Force. When you learn to quiet your mind, you hear them speaking to you. I did like the fact that we found out about the midichlorians in episode one, because we kind of like had no idea where this Force came from. We just knew that it surrounded us and binded the universe together. But, like, we had no idea what exactly that meant. And so I liked that in the first episode they kind of took a minute. It wasn't very long. I mean, that was the whole explanation. But I like how they explained what they are exactly and how it all works. Yeah, right on, like, what Tatooine and mm -hmm. talk about Little Anakin. Yep. So the like, mom can yeah. understand. Because, like, mom was like, what is this thing that you're talking about? Woody, what's in my child? <laughs> and so, like, he was kind of explaining. It was kind of cool. May the force be with you. And with you. And, and always with you. All energy from the living force, from all things that have ever lived, feeds into the cosmic force, binding everything and communicating to us through the midichlorians. I am a manifestation of the force, a force that consists of two parts. Living beings generate the living force, which in turn powers the wellspring that is the cosmic force. I feel like that's a really good name for Remember, concentrate on the moment 
Feel. Don't think. Uh, Use your instincts. Like a space, like agency, the cosmic the force. The are a microscopic life form yeah. that resides within all living cells. And we are symbionts with the life forms living together for mutual advantage. Without the midichlorians, life could not exist. And we would have no knowledge of the force. They continually speak to us, telling us the will of the force. When you learn to quiet your mind, you'll hear them speaking to you. Which is why I've never heard them, because I have no idea how to quiet my mind. Very true. I drive I without no the radio idea. on, and he thinks I'm crazy. I, mm, if there's not something playing in my car, uh, no. No, we turned it. Oh, I turned it just off. Just a little oh, bit. That's okay. Ah, that's we okay. That repeating. was close enough. We were starting to repeat anyway. We were repeating. So, um, just as a um, another heads up, I'm going to play the other Qui-Gon just to show you that they have the same voice and same quote lines. But we're not jipping you. Nobody likes it. Nobody likes to be jipped. All energy from the living force, from all things that have ever lived, feeds into the cosmic force, binding everything. And of course, we get the long one. To us through the midichlorians. Well, at least it's not the whole th the whole spiel about what the midichlorians are. I feel like that one's like a book. I feel like that thing could put me to sleep because I mean that's his kind of voice. Okie dokie. So we have two Yodas. We have a um, Yoda Cup 4 and a Yoda Cup 3. Um, both have the same RFID, right? Uh, yes, they do. Yep. Um, so that means they have the same uh, voice in them, just like the Qui-Gon. So I'll do the same thing. Um, so pick one. So oh, bigger one again. So, or a smaller uh, one, so actually. This is a small one. Too. So this is the cut four we're going to show you guys, and then afterwards we're going to show you the cut three as just a, hey, we're not jipping you out of a sound. It's prettier from the side. Yeah, it's the pretty side. Fear is the path to the dark side. Fear leads to anger. Anger leads to hate. Hate leads to suffering. I sense much fear in you. So the Yoda was originally voiced by Frank Oz, who's actually very famous for the Muppets. I mean, he voiced, I think, the majority of the Muppets. He's Kermit. Um, so, I mean, it was really cool when I found out that it was Frank Oz, who, because, I mean, he was the guy to go to for the puppeteering. Yeah. And, like, they were like, yeah, no, there's nobody else. Frank Oz, that's who we go to. And so it was really cool to when I found out that it was Frank Oz that did the voice. Obviously, he didn't do it in some of the other stuff that they did because he was dead. But it was really good to have him. I know. It's kind he of was dark. dead. It's kind of dark. I went dark there for a minute. Because he's no longer with us. I think he's dead. I could be wrong. I think he's dead. I mean, I hope he's not, but I don't think my hopes are going to matter in this case. He's a force ghost. Yes. I mean, he's so awesome. Feel the force. Oh, yes, good. Through the force, things you will see, other places, the future, the past. For my ally is the force, and the powerful ally it is. Life creates it, makes it grow. Its energy surrounds us and binds us. Luminous beings shall be not this crude matter. You must feel the force around you. Push you, on the side? Yeah, yeah. you don't have to push too hard. Yes, Jedi strength flows from the force. But beware of the dark side. Anger, fear, aggression. The dark side of the force are they. Easily they flow, quick to join when they fight. If once you start down the dark path, forever will it dominate your destiny, consume you at will, as it did Obi-Wan's apprentice. It did. We all know that story. That the old chestnut. fought I did, consumed by fear that was. Though she and I did not, 
a challenge lifelong it is not to then feel into anger. For my ally is the force, and the powerful ally it is. Life creates it, makes it grow. Its energy surrounds us and binds us. Luminous beings, so we, not this crude matter. You must feel the force around you. I always love Yoda. So wise. May the force be with you. And with all of you. Very succinct and to the point. Concentrate. Feel the force flow. Yes. Good. Through the force, things you will see. Other places, the future, the past. Um, so just as a reference, I'm going to do the other one for you. So this is number three, or cut three. Here is the path to the dark side. Fear leads to anger. Anger leads to hate. Hate leads to suffering. I sense much fear in you. Preemptive push. Thousands of Jedi once there were. Then came war. In our arrogance, join the conflict swiftly we did. Fear, anger, hate. Consumed by the dark side, the Jedi were. A long time fought I did, consumed by fear that was. Though she did, I did not. Surprised, are you? A challenge lifelong it is not to then feel into anger. When we first got all of our, when we first got some of the repeat voices, we thought that different crystals had different sets of voices because we would hear certain voices on certain crystals and not on other crystals. And then we eventually found out that it was just because they don't repeat on like a regular cycle. Uses the force for knowledge and defense. Never attack. Yeah, but as you like sit here for hours. 20 minutes and you just keep playing the same crystal you'll get all of the voices just by doing it and if you record you can hear them all long time fought i did See? consumed by fear that was so we got two so voices we got two voices that we didn't hear on the first crystal which is why i wanted to show you but all the other voices we heard on the other crystal yeah. and that's just because you know just by luck. Um, so just like in the red video of the red crystals, we have a eight ball. This is a cut board, and this is going to be a Yoda eight ball. So it's a different RFID tag. Yes, and it's going to be just like you would have with a magic eight ball, but with Yoda voice and Yoda sayings with like magic eight ball outcomes. So like Vader's were unique Vader magic eight balls, this is gonna be the Yoda version. You know, it's funny because everyone looks for the snow crystal because the black crystal is the one that everyone talks about being super rare. Yeah, super rare. But we've actually found out that Vader eight balls and Yoda eight balls are probably way more rare for a few reasons. First off, they don't seem to have the same uh, frequency as to how they're played so nobody knows where they are they look like a vader but they could be just a standard vader or yoda but also because it seems as though um they're not what am i thinking of they're, they're not they're not like regularly thrown out like some boxes may not have them others do have them and so like we've only heard of a few people getting them naturally in the wild we got lucky and we got a few but like there's so many people that are struggling to find a Vader 8-ball and a Yoda 8-ball in the wild. They do exist in the wild, yes, but they're very uncommon and very hard to get. And I, I think it all depends on when they build the crates to ship it. 
it's all like, oh, we're going to throw Yodas and we're going to throw Vader's, we're going to throw Mace Windu's and Luke's. And I think they just have like a bin of like, they just toss them all in and they just like go off that handful. Yeah. And, you know, those eight balls are just somewhere in the Yoda and Vader bins. It's so hard. I mean, I'm not saying that's how it's done because I don't work at the Kyber factory. Yeah, we have no idea where they are. But, you know, just because they're not as, you know, common as any of the other crystals, that's how I think. And, you know, you can kind of think about, okay, you know, in every, you know, box there's like maybe, maybe what, four blacks? Uh, you you don't know how many eight balls there could yeah. be no eight balls you know you can be at the park and constantly buying reds and greens and spending hundreds of dollars and you can't even get an eight ball yeah and so how many eight balls are they throwing out in the world you don't know and the best we know by what we've seen and what we've heard is that all the vader and yoda eight balls are the same cut as yoda and vader um that's what we're going off of like, like I said, we haven't found them with any great frequency, nor have we found anybody that's had any with great frequency. So that's the best we got, and that's what we're going with. Yeah. So with all of that aside, here is the uh, eight ball. That's the eight ball. Always in motion is the future. Will people like, comment, and subscribe on this video? In harmony with the Force, your path is. I think that's a yes. I'm gonna go. Um, let's ask him one more time. Like, comment, and subscribe. Shrouded in darkness, this path is not cool. Okay, you didn't you didn't answer or word word it correctly. Are my viewers going to like, comment, and subscribe? Ah, oh, see? Yeah, it's just, you gotta ask it the right way. Okay, okay, here, how about this? Tim, are you subscribed to my channel? A certain case, is it? See? See? Are, are you? Yes. I think, yeah, I am, I am. I hope so. <clears throat> Always in motion is the future. Much to learn, you still have. Yep. That's true. We all do. Yeah, like editing my videos. You must unlearn what you have learned. But that, isn't that the exact opposite? Of, okay. How do you unlearn what you learned when you learn your way. So, Master Yoda, what do you think so far about my videos? Do you like them? It is the will of the Force. That's not really helpful. Not, not very clear. Um, uh, not, not very do, clear. Do you like my videos about Kyber Crystals? In harmony with the Force, your path is... Still not helping. That's, You're killing me, Smalls. I'm, I'm asking if you like my content. Meditated on this question, I have. My answer is yes. Ah, right. there we go. Okay. That, that's what, yeah, that's See, what Yoda doing. likes my videos. So you, you should. You should like my videos, so give me a thumbs up. <laughs> and ring Keep that bell. Mind on where you are. <laughs> on what you are doing. Yes. A certain date this is. I think we've started to repeat. That's fine. Yeah. It is the will of the Force. So, that is Yoda Eat Ball. Oh. So that marks all of the green crystals. So there are five different, vo five different, sorry, there are four different cuts. There are five different total combinations you can get with the eight ball, the two Qui-Gons, and the two Yodas. It's confusing. So I confusing. know. Watch my first video. Definitely. You learn a lot. Have questions. Let me know. I got you. She does. She has to inform me all the time. Everyone's calling me the crystal lady. Yeah, she's into crystals these days. It's kind of funny. <laughs> all right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you all later. Bye.